Aero tip, how to pick the right time trial suit. Now, with all of the wind tunnel testing we've done, both with the leading pro athletes in the world, as well as age groupers, we've seen that you can't say which is the fastest suit in the world. Now, the reason for that is because the suit has a strong dependency on the rider's position. So for example, the shape of their back, the position of their head. But there are some things that we've seen that you can take with you when you're choosing the best suit. Now, the most important thing is that Air doesn't like skin, so you want to have a long sleeved suit to cover as, most of the, as much of the arm as possible. And similarly on the legs, you want, to take the, um, you want it to go as close to the knee as possible. Now the next thing we've seen is you want a suit that has the least number of wrinkles as possible and that fits you really nicely. Now the areas to pay particular attention to are on the outside around the shoulders and similarly on the outside on the side of your body. In these areas you want it to be as, as flat as possible without any wrinkles. Interestingly enough, if you've got some wrinkles on the inside, it doesn't make much of a difference. So what we've seen is that you can save with a good one piece uh, time trial suit uh, upwards of 15 watts at 35 kilometres an hour. And what that means is, is around about one and a half to two minutes uh, per hour on the bike. So there's huge savings to be made with a good one-piece suit. So remember, when you're picking the suit, pick one with long sleeves and as well as close to the knee as possible, that fits as tightly as possible and has, as, has the least number of wrinkles as possible around the outside of the body, on the shoulders and on the sides. And you'll have some free speed to make you faster.